expecting actually a really quiet day here at home and temperatures generally are close in the 30s and it looks like for Washington DC they will actually be looking at some decent weather as well. That's good especially for DC you never know what you're going to get out there. <laughs> well that's true here too but let's take a look here in Washington DC for uh, the inauguration. They're looking at temperatures at noon about 40 degrees and in the afternoon temperatures in the uh, lower 40s so overall a pretty nice day. Here at home though not quite as nice of a day. Uh, we are expecting to see snow showers likely after about nine o'clock or so this morning and we're expecting uh, around an inch or so of accumulation. A lot of the snow that does come today is not going to stick to the ground because the ground temperature is just too warm. Uh, we will see though reduced visibilities and still wet roadways and a few slick spots are still possible out there. Snow showers will come to an end later this evening from west to east and then tomorrow we are expecting mostly cloudy skies and a chilly day for the holiday. Right now live Doppler 2 HD is quiet. There's a lot of low clouds in the vicinity so you still may see a flurry or a little bit of drizzle out there early this morning but as we expand the picture here you can see that there's an upper level low that is spinning across parts of northern Illinois right now. The snow extends down into parts of central and southern Indiana and it's approaching Ohio as we speak. Should be in here after nine o'clock or so and we'll see periods of snow showers as we go throughout much of the day today. Our winter weather index is still low. We'll see reduced visibilities from time to time so just be aware of that as you're headed out. There may be a few slick spots out there but for the most way most part the roads will generally be wet as we go throughout the day here. So right now the roads are wet. There could be a couple slick spots but really not too many problems out there. Throughout the afternoon though snow showers with reduced visibilities will be the main impact and then this evening snow showers will be ending with around an inch or less. Many locations picking up a half an inch or less because it's not really going to stick very much. Currently 32 in Bell Fountain as well as in Greenville at this hour in Dayton coming in at 34 degrees. Southwest winds at 9 miles an hour. Pressures at 2976. Factor in the wind. It feels like it's in the upper 20s right now outside. If you're taking your dog out for a walk uh, much of the day though we are expecting to see those snow showers in the vicinity. Temperatures pretty much holding steady in the lower 30s. Tomorrow for the holiday we're looking at mostly cloudy skies and temperatures will be in the lower 30s as we top out tomorrow but we'll be lucky if we see much sunshine at all tomorrow. Just pretty much planned for a lot of clouds. Uh, Future track will track in that uh, snow showers, as you can see here, especially for this afternoon. And everything will end from west to east as we go throughout the evening. Mostly cloudy skies overnight tonight, and then expect a lot of clouds for tomorrow. Today, snow showers around an inch or less. Temperatures pretty much holding steady, 34, 35 degrees at best today. Tonight, though, we'll see those snow showers end from west to east. And overnight low of 27. Winds will still be a little bit breezy out of the southwest at 6 to 12. Then tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies. There could be a lingering flurry early on in the morning, but otherwise most of the day should be dry. Temperatures topping out right at freezing, so a little bit colder tomorrow. Your extended Storm Team 2 forecast here. You can see much of the week ahead looks pretty quiet and temperatures staying generally in the 30s, which is seasonable.